Hello, this is Mr. Hornby83. Um, here with my review of Halloween Resurrection. Now, I didn't do it last night. I explained it all on Facebook Live, so I'm not going to go through explaining it. If y'all want to find out why I didn't do it, just check out that video. Um, but, Halloween Resurrection. Now, when I, uh, when I did a commentary of this movie, I did realize there are some con some some pros to this movie. One of them being the first 15, which is pretty much this scene and this scene. Well, between this scene and this scene. Uh, first 15, uh, there were some pretty nice deaths in this movie. I mean, the movie's still hot garbage, it doesn't matter. Anyway, it goes, no matter what the pros are. The movie's still hot garbage. But, and I found out when I was doing my commentary where it was when he, with the stupid, dumb, him telling off Michael Myers, which I think it starts here, goes into here. Now, I haven't, I hadn't watched this movie prior to the commentary I did. Um, prior to the commentary I did, Friday. Um, I didn't realize there was a sex scene in the movie. I completely didn't realize. That's how much I've not watched this movie since. Oh, funny Freddy. <laughs> but yeah, this movie is the worst Halloween movie. I even considered it one of the worst horror movies ever, but then I forgot about movies like Trolls and that. But, you know, I guess I called this one the worst horror movies ever because I was a big fan of the Halloween franchise. But anyway, uh, yeah, Buster Rhymes, the way it ends, Buster Rhymes Kung Fu, which I'll get to in a minute. But uh, you see it several times in this freaking movie. And, uh, uh, Fuck the rhymes come through. But, you know, them killing Laurie Strode off and wasting Jamie Lee Curtis for this movie really was a waste of freaking having her in it. But they killed her off. I, like I said, the movie should have ended at H2O because to me, H2O wasn't as great as people think it was. Honestly, that's my opinion. But that's the main character, also Buster Rhymes, Freddy, these freaking people, and you know, I don't care about none of these people in this movie, none at all, especially Buster Rhymes with the little stupid Michael Myers thing, this guy right here, uh, who cares, and then I didn't realize they gave a passionate moment to Buster Rhymes at the end of the movie. Even though he was comedy throughout this whole freaking movie, but they give him a serious, awesome, magnificent scene, uh, you know, powerful speech at the end of the movie, which really irritated me. And uh, the tease that there's going to be another one of these movies, but thankfully, they saw the errors of their ways and decided, let's not do any more, let's not put no more people through torture like Halloween Resurrection. And like I said, H2O wasn't as great as people make it out to be. And then that's, you know, people helping, what the heck, I don't know, it's just stupid. Also, they were doing the little stupid thing with reality shows, like, I guess, live, like YouTube or whatever, or some kind of freaking social media thing that was hosting this whole freaking party event, which, was, that was stupid within itself, but, uh, especially when it comes to Halloween movie. Now, a current horror movie, I don't have no problem with it, but, uh, <sighs> Alright, you know, I've said all I can say about this movie. I can't tolerate no movie. This movie, here's what my score is going to be. This movie does not deserve any stars, so you know what I'm going to give it? A Busta Rhymes Kung Fu out of five. That's what I'm going to give it. It don't deserve a one, don't deserve a two, don't deserve a three, don't deserve a four, don't deserve a five. It's a Busta Rhymes Kung Fu out of five. But... That'll do it for this video. Please like this video, leave a comment, subscribe for more. Follow me on my Facebook fan page, Mr. Orange Day 3 Topics. Follow me on Twitter at Mr. Orange Day 3. Check out my NFL video later tonight, and peace out.